Howdy folks and welcome back to How to Wow Add-ons and more. And last time we took a look at the details damage meters. Today we're going to take care of this guy right here in the middle. <laughs> uh, so we're going to go ahead and click yes to configure our settings. Now this is important. <laughs> okay. Uh, this will get you. Alright. Just default settings. Now remember my system volume is down to 10%. Okay, that's how loud that is for the high damage sounds. All right, and eh, low damage, you need to get out of the way, but it's not an emergency. Okay, yeah, move, <laughs> or failed alerts, and uh, friendly fire. I've never experienced friendly fire. Oh, okay, when fellow teammates are walking explosions, okay. So if somebody has a uh, uh, cooldown thing on them and they're walking closer to you, uh, this sound tells you run away from that person. All right, this you're standing in fire. Move, 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 move. <laughs> okay, uh, you. That's pretty much it. There's really not a whole lot to it. Uh, special alerts, eh, fatigue. Uh, it's really not that much. It's not that in depth. All right. That's it for GTFO. It's done. Okay. Now I'm going to pull this down out of there for right now. This is all voodoo. All of this, these three windows is voodoo. Not touching that right now. Now we're going to take a look at sexy maps. All right. We can right click on it and that opens up the options. Okay. Right now, it is not locked. So we're going to grab it, and we're going to drag it down below the Titan panel and a little bit to the left so that our icons around the map are showing up but not off the screen, okay? I wonder if I can get a better background. You know what? Let me see if I can find a better place uh, so that we can see the map better. Yes, when I first got flying, uh, geez, when was that? I don't even remember when it was. Dalaran was uh, still in Northrend. The first thing I did was fly up there and sit on that ring. That was my favorite place. I can't believe I just discovered something. <laughs> uh, let's go in here into a dark area. Uh, I guess in the inn? Up top? Whoa! Dismounted up high. Okay, we can see the map a lot better in here. All right, there we go. Now we'll right-click the map. Okay, so you can resize the map, which I'm fine with it being the default size. Auto zoom out delay, again, I'm also fine with that. You can zoom in, wait five seconds, and it'll zoom back out. That's all that is, okay? Uh, show the north tag. Yeah, I'm cool with that. We can keep that there. Doesn't bother me. Really don't need to do a whole lot else. We're going to use global profile. And of course, it's going to reload the UI. You're going to see a lot of things that reload the UI, especially when we get to installing Elf UI. Elf UI, almost everything reloads it. All right. <laughs> it's kind of annoying, but it gets it done. All right, so now let's take a look at more options. All right, let's, ah, I can't move this. You see, default interface, I can't move that. Borders. We have the mini-map shape, okay? We have faded circle small, which, eh, no. Uh, rounded bottom left, you see, you got that black background, uh, yeah. Uh, there it is. It's square here and then rounded back there. I don't like that either. Uh, what about diamond? Yeah, see? These are just the different shapes. Oh, yes, we can do a heart mini-map. Uh, hexagon. We have a large faded circle. Uh, which, what's the difference between... Oh, okay, yeah. So, what's the difference between this one and this one? Oh, okay. See, that's a solid circle. 
Okay, I got you. I got you. Uh, Route 66. Oh, okay, yeah, it's a road sign. Gotcha. Snowflake. Yeah, you can pretty much guess what these are. All right, I want to go with just a plain old circle. Simple. All right. Uh, background and edge. We're going to enable that. Uh, or not. I don't know about that. Uh, no, we're not going to enable that. We'll take that out. Fade. Like I said, there's all kinds of goodies in here. Uh, let's see here. Let's start with the runes. That's probably easier. Rune one. Wow. Uh, okay, so texture tint or artwork, background. Okay, uh, border. Uh, highlight. Ooh, that's kind of nice. Overlay. Now yeah, that's pretty similar to the rest of it. Artwork. We'll just leave it that way. Uh, let's see here. Mod, what? What the heck is that? No, let's not do that. Yeah, we'll just leave that default. <laughs> uh, about rune two. Uh, let's see here. Rune two. Are we going to do background? It didn't change. Border. Didn't change. Highlight. There it goes. That's how you can get rid of that part. Overlay. Okay, we're just going to go with artwork. Uh, what about this? Blend normal? Yeah, no, nah, it's doing that big square again. We'll just do that. There we go. You can disable the rotation if you want. You can change the speed of the rotation. I There's all kinds of little things you can do there. Okay. I'm fine with it. It's cool. I can leave it like it is. Uh, there's also presets. You can change how it looks. There's the blue rune circles. Which is pretty much what we have. Okay. There's the blue rune diamond. Which is that. Uh, let's see here. Blue square glow. You see, it's not just the runes. There's other things you can get. Uh, burning sun. That one looks pretty cool. Uh, let's see here. What? Oh, wow. No, no. I don't care for that one. Uh, what's this one? Diablo. Okay. Uh... Electric. Let's see what that one looks like. Yeah, no. No, no, no. Emerald? Eh, no, not so much. Uh, we're not... I don't think I want a square. Yeah, I don't want a square. Uh, jewels. What is jewels? No. Parchment. Okay. Uh, rogue? Oh, that one's neat. I kind of like that one. <laughs> I hadn't used that one before. I might use that one. Okay. Uh, ruins. Eh, no. Rustic. Eh, no. Shamanism. <laughs> nope, nope, nope. Uh, simple square. Gee, I wonder. <laughs> uh, space. What is space? Nope, because those plants are going to mess with my icons. I don't like that. Stargate? We all know what Stargate is. That doesn't look like Stargate. It's because the runes are in the way. Okay. Wood framed. Yeah, no. Let's go with Rogue. I like the way that one looked. That one's cool. <laughs> okay. Uh, buttons. Now... <laughs> buttons, as you can see, whenever I hover over the map, buttons appear. When I go away, they disappear. All right. You can leave it that way. That's fine. Or you can have buttons always show or never show. Uh, the map button, I like that one because sometimes I forget the M or the M's not convenient. I didn't mean to actually click that. Can I click it again? Yeah, okay. Um, let's see here. Tracking button. That's a good one to have. 
and see here I can move these I want the tracking button right up there details streamer will bring down a little bit it will bring this guy down a little bit so that it's not covering that class hall report will bring right down here by the clock that's fine where it is those are fine details I don't really need on here because details is down here and there's other ways to get it uh, which actually I'm thinking about this add-ons I don't need that one don't need that one don't need that one and I don't need that one dynamic buttons uh, on hovers fine dungeon difficulty indicator eh, that's fine garrison when available is fine um oh wait show garrison button when available always okay yeah guild dungeon difficulty new mail always on okay that one i think shows up right up here uh, right click to drag i will bring altaholic down here uh let's see here q status that should be right about here um yeah don't need the voice chat button standard buttons okay zoom in we're going to click and drag a little bit because it stacks them see it put that one in the same spot and there we go now it's fixed I now have my map how I want it we have a clock well we're, we're fine with the clock uh, coordinates check this out coordinates I didn't need to get an add-on for it <laughs> so I mean don't need an add-on uh, movers eh, I'm not worried about ping zone text I'm not worried about all that it's done now I can lock the mini map now it won't move all right and that covers GTFO and sexy maps. If you enjoyed the video, found it useful, please go ahead and leave a like, subscribe. If you had any questions or comments, please let me know on Twitter or Discord. I'll leave the links down in the description box. And that's it for today, folks. See you next time. Bye now.